22,000 children die each and every day as we go about our business, and we believe that number not only should be, but it has to be zero. Especially this year when we look at Haiti and Pakistan and some tremendous, tremendous difficulties that are facing so many children around the world today. It is actually awesome to take a moment to be able to look back and see what we've accomplished, what our plans are for the future, that we've met every goal. I love that UNICEF doesn't care about gender, they don't care about race, uh, they don't care about a political situation in a country, uh, or how difficult it may be to get to a child. All they care about is that a child needs help and they want to get there. We have now hit the two million dollar mark for tonight's celebration. Congratulations! UNICEF is one of the premier organizations raising money and awareness. Um, they've been around for an awfully long time. We do great work. Um, everyone that I've spoken with involved with, with the organization highly committed, highly intelligent, highly motivated. Well, the UNICEF Snowflake Ball is the one event every single season that everyone must go to, not just because it's a wonderful cause, and it is, and it saves so many children's lives, but because it is probably the most spectacular, star-studded, most beautiful event that really kicks off the holiday season. So it really is a privilege to work with everyone at the U.S. Fund for UNICEF, the George Harrison Fund, and hopefully we can keep George's legacy going for another 40 years. Because of George Harrison's spirit and compassion, I'm standing here tonight. He inspired me in every way, every day. And he told me to keep throwing pebbles into the ocean of need because one day those ripples would reach ashore and maybe make a difference.